The Princess of Wales showed off her abseiling skills today as she joined her husband Prince William for a whirlwind visit to Wales. Kate, 41, and the Prince of Wales, 40, are visiting the South Wales Valleys and Mid Wales over the next two days, and kicked off their trip by meeting Central Beacons Mountain Rescue Team, which is celebrating its 60th anniversary this year. The mother of three opted for a sporty look, donning the mountain equipment Congor MRT women's jacket, costing £600, grey trousers, a matching cap and hiking boots. William, who is patron of Mountain Rescue England and Wales, and Kate had the opportunity to engage in training activities such as abseiling, medical support exercises and a search dog rescue demonstration. Run entirely by volunteers, the Central Beacons Mountain Rescue Team has been working to keep the communities of Mid and South Wales safe since 1963. The team responds to calls 24 hours a day, year-round and covers the central area of the Banau Breichenayog National Park, which incorporates Pen Y Fan, the highest point in southern Britain, as well as the Y Stratfeld Waterfalls, Cardiff, Newport and the Valleys. During their time with the team, the Royal Couple will meet with current volunteers to hear about their roles and experiences of carrying out rescues, in addition to former team members spanning the organization's 60-year history. Later today, the Prince and Princess will visit the nearby Dolais Rugby Club where members of the team typically go to relax and socialize. Inside the club, the couple will spend time with Mountain Rescue volunteers, the organization's supporters, and members of the local community. Upon leaving the rugby club, they will spend some time meeting members of the public gathered outside. Prior to becoming a senior royal at the age of 35, William had a career as an RAF search and rescue pilot. He also worked as a pilot for the East Anglian Air Ambulance. The couple's engagement comes amidst a busy period for the pair, with Kate visiting a baby bank earlier this week to give out essentials to new mothers. The Princess of Wales made a surprise visit to a baby bank where she spoke of the importance of community initiatives and helped to sort through donations and baby grows for new mothers. Kate said she couldn't believe how quickly her son Prince Louis, who celebrated his fifth birthday the day before, had grown up and promised to bring her own family down to help out at the center in the future. The princess has visited several community initiatives in the Windsor area since her family moved there last year and told the organizers, who wrote asking if she would like to visit, that she was keen to see their work firsthand. Kate looked elegant in a beige 285 pounds blazer from Reese, which she paired with smart trousers and a plain white t-shirt. She finished off her outfit with a pair of 130 pounds pointed pumps from British brand Bowden. Meanwhile the prince and princess also celebrated their youngest son Prince Louis' birthday over the weekend.
the prince and princess released a number of photographs to mark his fifth birthday. The youngster sat atop a pile of garden cuttings in one of the relaxed pictures taken in the garden of Adelaide Cottage in Windsor, the family home. Proud parents Kate and William said they were delighted to share the images of their energetic youngest child tonight. In one of the pictures, Lewis, wearing shorts, shirt and a woolen jumper, was seen grinning at someone out of shot as he takes his wheelbarrow ride. The other is an intimate close-up of his smiling face. Not known for sitting still for long, Lewis, previously described by his mother as a kamikaze rugby player, is often pictured in an active stance. Unlike previous family portraits, however, these images were not taken by keen photographer Kate. Instead, the charming family moment was captured by Millie Pilkington, who was previously trusted by Kate and William to privately photograph their wedding reception in 2011. Prince Louis is expected to join his older siblings George, 9, and Charlotte, soon to turn 8, for the carriage procession at the coronation on May 6. While George, the second in line to the throne, is expected to have a role in the service, it is thought Louis will join working members of the royal family on the balcony at Buckingham Palace for an raft flypast, 